that and this is happily ever allen vlog we're a family based out of san diego and we have a 10 month old son so if you guys want to continue on with our journey then go ahead and click subscribe we are doing vlogmas so that means we're vlogging every day until christmas and today um i'm going to be making a recipe because joe said that his work has a Christmas party and it's a potluck. So I always make the same thing for potlucks because it's usually a pretty big hit. I make it for my family Thanksgiving, my family Christmas, um, any birthday parties. I even made it for some of my friends after they had babies and people usually like it. So what I'm going to make today is Kahlua pig and cabbage. If you don't know, I am originally from Hawaii, so it is a very popular dish there. And I'm going to be making it in a pressure cooker. And it's not an Instapot brand. We have the Power Pressure Cooker XL, but this can totally be done in an Instant Pot. And so if you would like to know how to make Kahlua pig and cabbage, it's super easy. Keep watching. Okay. So here are the ingredients. You need about three to five pounds of pork shoulder butt. And I like the butt because it, it usually gets the most tender. And then you want four slices of bacon. I like to get the one from the deli. It's like really thick cut and it's super fresh. It's not like the packaged kind. And then you need a half a cup of water, garlic to taste. I usually like a lot of garlic. And then three tablespoons of liquid smoke and one and a half tablespoons of Hawaiian sea salt. And I actually get my Hawaiian sea salt at cost plus, but if you have um, an Asian market near you, we're almost out, but um, this is the kind to, that I like to use. It's the Alea Sea Salt Medium Grains. It's from Honolulu and yeah, it's like really, really authentic Hawaiian salt. But I think some people have also substituted kosher salt, but I can't vouch that it tastes as good. So step one is to cut your pork into even pieces. Okay, step two is we're going to brown the meat on all the sides. All right, somebody's awake, so I had to bring him in the kitchen. You gonna watch mama cook? He loves these melties. These are like his favorite. And there's only three ingredients. All right, so nice and brown. Nice and brown on all sides. We're gonna put in four slices of bacon okay and then you're going to add your pork butt on top of the bacon and if you have like a fat side put that on the bottom pour in your water squeeze in the garlic Three tablespoons of liquid smoke. Okay. One and a half tablespoons of Hawaiian salt. So everything's in the pot and 
we're going to put the lid on. And then you're going to set this to um, pressurize, which is like, for this one, it's the circle meets the arrow. So, that. Okay, so we're going to put it on high pressure for an hour and a half. So we got, the canning is the high, high pressure. So I usually do that and then I do a time adjustment for an hour and a half. And that's it. The pork has about 20 minutes left so I'm gonna go ahead and cut the cabbage. put it inside a bowl just to move it out of the way. Okay, when it's all done, you're just going to let it naturally release. So, it just released, so it's going to let me open up Open this up. Okay, so then you're gonna take it out. Okay, so once you take out all the meat, you're gonna put your cabbage in the juices. You're gonna press saute. But press saute, and then you're gonna cook the cabbage in all of these juices and then just cook it down. While that's cooking, you're gonna put this meat in a bowl. We're gonna use um, a fork to shred it. going to do some pepper and then you add in the, the meat back in and you're going to stir it up and that's it and then you're all done and then you can serve it up I usually like to put it over rice and, and there's the finished product. So I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so much uh, for joining me on how